Why, hello there, friends. Welcome to Snowed In. Uh, my name's Finn, and I work here at the Inn with my family. I am just so glad to see you. Oh, I love it so much when new friends come to play with me in the snowy mountains. Speaking of snow, have you ever seen soft, white, chilly snow before? Yes! Wow, snow is my favorite. And as you can see, we have plenty to play in outside. Would you like to play with me in the snow today? Yes! Merry Mittens! Oh, this is gonna be so much, oh. Mittens, I almost forgot. Before we go play in the white chilly snow, we should probably make sure we're dressed in our warm, wintry, snowy clothes. First, we need to make sure our toes stay warm. Let's put on our snow boots. One boot. Two boots. Whew. And we can't forget to put on our warm and cozy jackets. Let's all put on our jackets together. All right. There we go. And great. You got it. We need to make sure we are bundled up tight. So everyone count to three with me as we snap on our jackets to stay warm. Here we go. One, two, and three. Oh, that feels so warm and toasty. Next, we need a hat. Our hat will keep our head nice and warm. Reach up high and put on your hat with me. There. <laughs> now, we only need one more thing and we're ready to go play in the snow. We have to put on our mittens so that our fingers don't get too frosty out in the snow. Everyone, hold up your hands and slide on your mittens, just like this. One mitten. Two mittens. There. Perfect. You look snowtastic. Now we're ready for the snow. To go outside and play in the snow, everyone stand up and let's do the snow dance together. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Pat your hat. Clap your mittens. Stomp your boots. Now freeze! Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Here we go, 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 it's gonna snow, snow, snow. Spin around. Jump up and down. High five a friend. Now freeze. Shimmering snowflakes. As you sit back down in your cozy spots, look at all this snow. I am so excited to play. But first, we need to go over the two rules we follow here at the Snowed Inn whenever we play outside in the snow. Okay. Can you hold up one of your mittens and say, be kind? Be kind. You got it. You can be kind by listening carefully so that you know how to play our snowy games. Now, let me see you hold up both of your mittens and say, be safe. Be safe. That's it. You can be safe by sitting down in your cozy seat while we play our games so you don't bump into any of our snow friends. I think we're ready now. Come on, let's go play in the snow. Wow, look at this huge pile of snowballs someone made for us to play with. 
everyone here just loves throwing snowballs at different targets when they're outside playing. Hey, have you ever thrown a snowball before? Well, I promise it's so much fun. But because we are kind and safe, we'll make sure to not throw snowballs at anyone's face. Instead, let's practice throwing a snowball at that tree together. Here we go. Let's pick up one round, cold snowball. Now, get ready to throw it on the count of three. One, two, three. Great job. Do you see all these snowflakes starting to fall? They are so beautiful. And just look at all the different shapes. Wait, I have an idea. Let's play a game and pretend those falling snowflakes are targets. We'll try to hit as many as we can. The more snowflakes we hit, the more points we'll earn. Are you ready? Yeah! Let's start trying to hit as many snowflakes as we can when I say snow. Everybody, get your snowballs ready. Here we go. On your mark, get set, snow! Snowtastic! We earned 50 points! Great job, friends. I promised we would have so much fun playing outside, and we sure did. But it did make me tired and super cold. We better get back to the end to warm up. Oh, let's use our sleds to get back quickly and catch snowflakes as we go. Here we go! Lean this way. Catch the snowflake. Catch the snowflake. Lean that way. Catch the snowflake. Lean this way. Catch the snowflake! Great job! You caught all the snowflakes! Melting marshmallows! It feels so nice and warm in here that... I don't think we need our snow clothes anymore. First, let's take off our mittens. Now, let's take off our hats. Ah! And let's take off our big warm jackets. And hang it up. Last but not least, let's take off those snow boots. All right. And whew. I had so much fun playing outside in the snow with you. It's too bad I can't play with the snow inside because it would melt. But I can play with my snow globe. It's my favorite. I love to look at all the snow in it, especially since I can't bring the snow inside with me. Now, this might look like just any old snow globe you would see at your house or at the store, but something snowtastic happens when we give it a shake. Do you want to see? Yes! I was hoping you would say so because my special snow globe is home to my friend, Minnie Moose. I can't wait for you to meet her. She tells the best stories ever, but to make it work, I need all of you to help me out. Everyone, hold up your pretend snow globe and give it a good shaky, shake, shake. Try it with me. Shaky, shake, shake. Well, hello, friends. While your toes get toasty, let me tell you a story. This story comes from the best book ever written, the Bible. Go ahead and use your frosty fingers to click on your listening ears. Click, click. click. 
That's it. Now you also need to put on your special eyes. Zoop, zoop, snow-tastic. When we read the Bible, we can see that God always does what he says he will do. Let's read a story and see how God keeps his promises. Today's story is about a man named Abraham. We read about Abraham in a book of the Bible called Genesis. One day, God promised Abraham that if he would love God and obey him, God would give Abraham many good things. And God kept that promise. God also promised to be with Abraham wherever he went. And God kept that promise too. Everywhere Abraham went, God was with him. Then God promised Abraham that he would have a really big family, bigger than all the stars in the sky. God said, I will always keep the promise I have made to you and your family, because I am your God and their God. But when Abraham's wife, Sarah, heard that God promised to give her a baby and a family, she laughed because she thought they were too old to have any babies. But God always keeps his promises. God gave them a baby boy named Isaac, and their family did grow to be bigger than all the stars in the sky. God promised Abraham good things. God promises you good things too. And God will do all he promises to do. We can see how God keeps his promises when we read the Bible. Let me hear you say this after me. God keeps... God keeps... His promises. His promises. I can't wait to discover more of God's promises with you. See you again soon. <laughs> I promise you that this snow globe was snowtastic and that Minnie Moose tells the best stories, didn't I? Yes! It was so cool to see how God promised Abraham good things, and then God kept all of his promises. I'm thankful that God keeps his promises and does what he says he will do. Let me hear you say this after me. God keeps... God keeps... His promises. His promises. And speaking of promises, that reminds me of a song I know. Let's all stand up and sing it together. You keep your promises. I know I can trust in you. When you speak it, God, you do it. Sounded great! You can take a seat back in your warm and cozy spot. That snowtastic song made me think of a verse from the Bible that I want to share with you. 
It goes like this. Say it after me. God makes God makes a promise a promise and then and then he keeps it. He keeps it. Numbers 23:19. You got it. <clears throat> All that singing made me thirsty for some yummy hot chocolate. Would you like some too? Yes. Yes. <laughs> well, let me see you all hold up your mugs. Just like this. Now, I'm going to pour us some warm, yummy, hot chocolate. Make sure you hold your mugs nice and still. You don't want to spill it. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> that looks like just the right amount. But this hot chocolate is definitely missing something. Hmm. I know. It's missing the yummy marshmallows that go inside. Here at Snowed In, we get a marshmallow for our hot chocolate if we can remember what we learned from Minnie Moose. Can you help me answer some questions so that we can get some marshmallows to go in our yummy hot chocolate? Yes! Oh, goody. Well, here's our first marshmallow question. Did God promise bad things for Abraham or good things? Good things! That's right. God promised good things for Abraham, like being with him everywhere he went and giving him a big family. Snowtastic. We got our first marshmallow. Let's drop it inside of our mug. <laughs> Great. Okay, here's our next marshmallow question. Does God break his promises or keep his promises? Keep his promises. Yes, God always does what he says he will do and he keeps his promises. Yippee! We got our second marshmallow for our hot chocolate. Now, let's drop it in our mug. That's it. It's almost time to drink it. But before we take our first sip, we need to blow on it to make sure it's not too hot to drink. Everyone, blow on your hot chocolate with me. <sighs> Great job. I think it's ready to drink now. Let's take a sip on the count of three. One, two, three. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. Do you like it? Yes! Well, mine tastes delicious. I don't know about you, but I need to find a snack to go with this yummy hot chocolate. And all of you need to be getting back to your rooms. But before you go, don't forget that God loves you and promises to always love you. And you know, he always does what he says he will do because, well, let me hear you say this after me. God keeps, God keeps his promises. His promises. Snowtastic. Be sure to bundle up if you go back out in the snow. I can't wait to play in the snow with you again at Snowden real soon. Bye.